Hey, what's up? I'm the Zim. This is the Zim video, and this is my video about five tips to a five star rating in less than five minutes. I've been driving for Lyft since February 2017. Currently, have a five star rating on my app with 2,672 rides, and on July 29th and 30th, I managed to maintain a perfect five star ratings for at least 129 rides I was able to get every rated ride to be five stars so that's awesome so anyways let's get into this idea um, the first thing well not the first thing this is in no particular order just in order of that I chose first thing that to consider to get a five star rating for uh, driving for ride share is your looks how good looking are you and you know, that may be a polarizing idea, but it it's a factor. Our society is based on sex appeal and things like that, so it definitely plays a factor in whether or not people appreciate your services, how much you look. And if you're not blessed with model mo model caliber looks, then there are things that you can do. Do you exercise? Do you diet? Do you put your makeup on? Do you comb your hair? Do you shave your face? Do you do the things that make you look more presentable? Um, Something to consider for that five star rating. Second thing is your car. Um, perceived value is a very big thing in this society. So the better your car is, the more apt you are to possibly get a better rating. Um, a lot of people wonder why, oh, but my car's clean and all this stuff. But if it's a jalopy, an old school, whatever, cloth seats and all that stuff, then it doesn't look and feel as good. People might not rate you as high. I'm currently driving a Chevrolet Malibu, which is pretty awesome. It's got the leather seats. People really dig it. It's clean. All that good stuff. So new, you know, premium style car will help out your rating a lot. Um, something to consider. Next thing is, well, what I just mentioned, how clean is your car? The, the next three things I think are the more obvious than the last two I mentioned, but how clean is your car? Is it, um, you know, making sure there's not any, the outside and interior are as spotless as possible? will go a long way to, and smells good, all that kind of stuff, will go a long way to getting your five star rating. Um, customer service, obviously, how friendly are you? How much do you allow the customer, how much do you fall into that idea of the customer is always right? Um, you know, do you confront them or argue with them based on the GPS directions? How often do you let the customer tell you where to go? Do you say, no, I need to go by the GPS or do you go, hey, wherever you want? You're better up, better off to go like wherever the customer wants to go is where you go, even if it means a longer route. That's fine with me. There's many times where I've been driving and watching the GPS um, minutes go up as the passenger says, "Oh, I know a better way." So whatever, let them have it. Um, just customer service, saying please and thank yous and all that good stuff. Um, welcoming into the car, smiling, being cordial. And then the last thing is, what do you offer? Do you have? Do you offer water, cell phone um, power, mint, gum, candy? What extras do you offer to your customer when they're in the car? And that will help your rating go up and stay up. So, do you agree, disagree? I'd love to hear about it. Feel free to comment in this video. Let me know what your thoughts are. Um, also. If you want to, if you found this because you want to become a driver, use my referral code ZIM200 and we both get bonuses for Lyft if you want to become a Lyft driver. And then if you like my ideas, if you want to learn more about my ideas on rideshare driving on this channel, there's um, a series of videos called My Rideshare Experience and I do it almost every week. And you can check out more of my thoughts, how much I make every week, just different ideas that have come up over the week of this rideshare job that I do. So, all right, thanks for joining. Be sure to subscribe, give the thumbs up, do all that fun YouTube -y stuff. We'll catch you next time. Peace.